You were kind of a late arrival on campus. Just what's that been like uh, trying to catch up with the rest of the guys? And where do you see yourself right now with this team? Well, as a late arrival to campus, I always had to like pick up new aspects. I've been in the gym with the coaches previously, and they helped me kind of learn individually what I was going to have coming up when the practice started. And when the practice started, it was more or less just listening to coaches and learning everything that they put out there for me and just listening, paying attention, and then applying it to what we do on the floor. Being from Lincoln, you've watched this Illinois program from, you know, from a close distance. What have you seen from Coach Underwood and what he's done so far? And was that a deciding factor in you coming here? What I've seen from Coach Underwood is just like, it helps me kind of prepare myself for what to expect, especially just the way he coaches. It's different from a few other coaches. So I felt like it was something I could handle. And when he, when I, when he approached me personally, he was such a nice guy, the way he talked about me. He just really liked the way I played, and, and if somebody has that much like confidence in what I could do, then I feel like it would be great for me to step on the floor and coach and play for him. Playing for a legendary coach and Neil Alexander over at Lincoln, you know, his son Jeff's on the squad here. I'm sure you, you knew Jeff, you know, for a long time, you know, playing over there at Lincoln. But just with this group, you know, you've got Kofi, you've got Georgie, yourself, Benjamin Bossmans, Verdonk. Just, you got a lot of length this year. Just talk a little bit about what that's going to be like playing with a lot of uh, guys, you know, same similar size. I mean, when we're on my team, it helps us a lot because we have a lot of length and size that would benefit us when we get out there, start playing for real. And just like the ability that we have offensively and defensively is going to help us get through the season and come out on top. What do you see your role as with this team for this year? Well, Currently, I feel like the defensive presence in the paint that I can jump like shots and just work hard defensively. And whatever I need to do offensively will definitely happen. Uh, obviously, you weren't here last year to see you know Kofi's annex on and off the court, but it seems like uh, Kofi is just like what Georgie was. So what's it going to be like having two of those guys on the on the team at the same time? I mean, it's great. They're both really good guys. They're both physical, strong on the court, and when it comes to being off the court, they're just great people to be around. Well, hey, Jermaine, how you doing, man? What's this been like? I mean, this has been fast. I mean, we talked day of, but here you are now. What's this process been? It's a great experience to be out here and play for this team. You know, the teammates are amazing, and I just love being around them. They're on and both on and off the court. They're just great people to be around. We always around each other, doing you know, wherever we can, just build a relationship and a friendship as close as we can because in the end the bond is always what we want. It helps us play better on the court, on the court and hopefully it's gonna help us win. I'm trying to remember your freshman year at Lincoln. Did you make the varsity team? Um no I did not. <laughs> what did so at that point did you ever think you would be wearing it up? At that point no. It was just like basically when that time came I had to improve and the coaches there helped me get better every single year. It's an improvement from then and now it's just Dramatical. It's just amazing. What's the process?